Hi, this is the Rutland and Stamford Property Market Update News and this week we're reporting from the wonderful village of Manton. David, let's hear from you on what the property market's been doing and what's been selling. Well, the average price of a property in Manton currently stands at 437,000, uh, which is way above the national average, but pretty similar to other Rutland uh, villages. Mm -hmm. Um, in the last two years, only six properties have, have completed in the village, which Gosh. is a small amount. It's not a particularly big village, but I guess it just shows you that once you're bought in the village, you don't really want to move it, move on because it's such a uh, great place to mm -hmm. live. Uh, of those properties, four have been detached and two semi-detached, which pretty, pretty much probably mirrors uh, the housing stock, which is made up of your traditional period uh, properties. There are a number of 1970s properties, uh, a row of, uh, a couple of rows of gorgeous cottages. So yeah, a real mixture. Uh, here's an example of a property that's recently sold, which was actually sold by Pelham James last year or the year before, which was a renovation project mm. from 1970s, which was on Priory Road, which sold for 790,000. Incredible views there. It was really something special that was. Yeah. I would love to have worked on that and yeah. done some really cool design, grand design on that place. Yeah, I think Priory Road in Manton has to be one of my favourite mm -hmm. streets in the whole of Rutland. Mm -hmm. uh, it's such a quiet street, it's no through road and uh, the houses on one side all have views of the water which is where this property was so here, yeah here you can see a picture of the views and uh, you can see it's a 90 i think it was about 1950s 1960s house uh, had a beautiful garden and uh, some lucky uh, yeah. people are currently in the midst of really uh, major renovation of home. Absolutely. Uh, yeah we can't wait to see that when it's uh, hmm. finished so the population of manton is only 364 people people. Mm -hmm. uh, it is, as we said, in the village of Rutland. Uh, it's great in terms of location for the local town of Uppingham and also Oakham. But Lottie, do you want to go into a bit more detail about what really attracts people to, to this can. village? I You've mentioned it already. It's Rutland Water. It's literally a stone's throw yep. from here. Um, and of course, a fab pub. I love a village with a great pub. And this is one of um, the areas really very finest ones they've done a lot of work they've extended to the side and got a lovely raised decking area fabulous menu so it's great to have a good pub in your village of course and of course it's a great stop off for if you're either walking running or cycling around Rutland Water absolutely we've done that walk on Christmas Day with the kids and the dog which was nice yeah. isn't it so it's a really great place um, just Slightly out of the village, you've got, of course, Rutland Water Golf Club. Yeah. Um, that's popular. You've played there with our yeah, son, of course. Stunning views of the and water some friends, on the course. Really lovely course. A um, bit further along again, you've got Rutland uh, Water Nursery. They've got their great cafe. They're developing and expanding their offering as well, and that's really super. Um, so it's got a lot going for it, and I, as you said, also really close by, you've got the market towns of. Uppingham and Oakham and, and Stamford, so you're in a little triangle really here yeah. of offering fab village life, wonderful uh, landscape and scenery. You've got the, um, the nature reserve, of course, again, we're on foot from here. It's the main place to visit the Ospreys as well, it isn't it? It is, yeah. um, so a, a really wonderful and um, vibrant community, yet you've got country living literally all around you. It's gorgeous. I love Manton. Yeah, so um, if you're interested in looking to purchase in this village or any of the surrounding village or indeed have a house in the village that you'd like an up-to-date valuation, then please do get in touch. We'd love to hear from you.